Corey here, St. Paul, Minnesota. I've got a wonderful example of a uh, AC Fairbanks Imperial Electric Banjo from 1906. This one came from the Jim Bowman collection um, and it is in great shape. The pot is 10 and 3 quarters inches. It has the signature, of course, the signature rag that I put in the back, but the signature white lady tone ring, or uh, electric tone ring, which you find on the white ladies later on. And as you can see from the video here, the pot is in great shape. The hardware is in great shape. Uh, really kind of unique for ones of this era that I've seen. Um, the scale on this is a very comfortable 10, or excuse me, 26 and a quarter inches um, on an ebony board and engraved inlays all the way up. Jim told me his uh, uh, repair guy did uh, some engraved restoration, engraving restoration on the peg head. It looks to me like the nut has been replaced at some point uh, and it works just fine. There's some wear on the fretboard in the lower positions, but not bad, and it doesn't affect playability. Frets are in really good shape. Uh, what neck relief there is uh, doesn't seem to affect the playing or the intonation as you work your way up the neck. Um, I like it a little high, and this is uh, bridge is set at three eighths of an inch. The action's at five thirty seconds, plus change at the twelfth fret. Anyhow, if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to get a hold of me. Um, this is on Reverb and Banjo Barn, and uh, be happy to answer any questions you might have. Thanks for looking.